what's up everybody and welcome back to the Pauli Pau Pau Show. What we're gonna do today is talk about mixing and how different music affects us personally and how it affects people around us. I had a comment the other day and it was about, um, and you know usually I don't I disagree with the comments but deep down I, I did so I want to bring it up and what it is is somebody commented uh, posted and said um, and please don't hate and don't read the comments and hate on anybody I'm gonna use this to my advantage just like sounds in an NPC um, said dude you, if you're use if you're not making your own music and and we all know where this is going and if you're not making your own beats and your your own music then you're not and you sell it to an artist that you're not giving that that artist who buys it isn't singing with their soul. I'm like, meaning like I'm like, dude, music affects everybody differently. Um, I don't know if you know that, but I mean, it's when you hear a song. It's like saying you can't dance to the same song because you didn't make it. You know, it's like, oh, you didn't write that song. Everybody stopped dancing, and. Uh, only let the guy who created that song dance. That doesn't sound very cool to me. It sounds like maybe you're afraid that maybe somebody else might be able to dance better than you. Is all I'm saying is that no, you don't have to just produce your own music and write your own melodies. Like you just pluck melodies that no other human on earth can pluck out. No, dude, it's a scale and you play it in the same flip-flop of shape somebody else does. I get making your own beats and the royalties and all that and that's legit. I get it. I don't want to talk about it no more. But but yeah, it's, just think about that, dude. Don't don't hate on people that are using samples and and stuff like that, you know, I mean Everything is a sample, whether it's your snap or anything like that. It's an original sound or something else. If it motivates you to move forward in life in general, then yeah, do it. Use it. I don't care what anybody says. Other than that, guys, I've done a few of the uh, teaching classes, and they've been great, man. I've had, like, there's nothing like being able to see uh, your workflow and to be able to see somebody overcome that intimidation of the NPC whenever you get it. And it's like, what do I do with it? A week later, you find out how to load in the plug-in. And it's just like, it's taking forever. I just want to make music. So I have had a class, and it's been really, really cool. And big shout-out to everybody who's supported me and everything like that. It's been really, really cool. And uh, like I say, you can hit me up anytime if you need anything. Uh, now, this week, I want to really focus on sending out different projects. Like, um, like this song right here. Like, especially if you've had the class, like, and I've showed you how to take that whole one sequence and then stretch it out into eight, and, and we muted out the parts and everything like that. But now this song right here, let's say if I wanted to um, send this out email and have you guys mute out the parts on something like this. You know, because it's got, as you can see, I got like 30-some tracks, and there's just so much you can do with it. And the reason I do that is the same way, like I say, I load up all of my sounds first. This way I don't have to go back and do any of that. Now I got all these tracks that I can do, and then I can wipe out the drums. And yeah, there are my own melodies and everything, which I respect what to do with saying, but I'm saying, don't say that you're not putting your heart and soul if a, if a, a rapper's rapping over your beat and everything, and he's really meaning it. Mot that beat motivated that person to to be able to express himself, is all I'm saying. So, just be, with all the different arrangements that you can do, uh, I think that's a really cool thing. So, if you want to send like a project archive and uh, have me run it through my MPC, or if you want me to actually mix, because sometimes whenever you're um, mixing the MPC comes out, it, it doesn't sound quite radio ready. I don't know if you see the uh, decibel meter on the right. I mean, the kicks and full level come out at zero, so you want to leave it there just like that. And you can turn up the levels and really work that. But if you just wanted to make the beat and you want to go ahead and just send it to me in the email or whatever, um, I'd be more than happy to, to track it out because I can show you how to track it out, of course, if you don't know how to. 
and I'll send it through here and I can tweak it out to where it sounds nice and nice and crisp. It'll sound different than being mixed in an MPC. So I thought that would be an extra service that maybe I would um, incorporate in the teaching that I'm doing. Um, other than that, guys, um, practice makes perfect. I don't want to make this video too long, but I just I want to thank the subscribers that have been subscribing. I got a lot of things to go over, and I just want you to know that I am here. If you do need any help with the MPC, you can leave them in the comments. There's not one comment that I, I've left unmarked, I don't believe. I try to get back to all of you, and I don't check my spam email, so if you send me something, email, and I haven't got back to you, forgive me on that. But, um, yeah, other than that, guys, rock on. Keep on playing on your MPC. I'm going to, like I say, if you want this project, I can send it to you. It will work in standalone because it's all standalone sounds. Like if you just bought your MPC and never hooked it up to a computer or anything like that you know and you're running 2.8 anyway or 2.7 and above all these sounds and everything will just pop up whenever you load the file so if you're interested in doing that maybe next week I'll be able to uh, take all of those and collaborate them into a video and show what different people uh, did with the song you know just bouncing different ideas off of other artists is a beautiful thing so I just I'm gonna end it there Fade out this song and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks again guys for watching the Pauly Pow Pow Show.